Welcome to the first annual Go Hunt Marchery Madness. We got contestants, they're pumped up. We're in the Go Hunt warehouse and we're about to sling arrows. We got an iron buck here. You miss here, it's gonna be awkward. It's gonna be a good match. We got brackets, we got seeds. I'm trying to lay odds right now. Welcome to the show. First, our number one seed, Brandon Evans. 25 plus years of archery experience. Favorite state is Colorado from Cedar City, Utah. Favorite musician is Gabe Miller. Not sure what to make of that. Seed number two, Trail. A lot of people don't realize his full name. Clinton Forrest Trail Kretzker. Seed two, he did the seed ranking. I don't really agree with the seed two. He should really be a seed one. I think he's the, the actual favorite. Hobby running. Favorite musician, Mac Miller. Seed three, Camp Daddy, also known as Brian Campos. He's been archery hunting since he was six years old. Favorite state to hunt is Wyoming. He's a break dancer. Seed four, Braden from our Utah office. He's been hunting since he was 10 years old. Hobby, lifting weights, hunts all states. And Lorenzo Sartini is seed number five. A little low, like, like, I think he's a little stronger favorite than that. Uh, Hobby the gym. Just the gym. A little meatheadish, but I still love him. Sixth up, Payton, our military intern. Been hunting since he was 14. He's a, hobbies are carpentry, mechanic, building and destroying things. Interesting, those are all co correlated and related. Six C, Branson Jackson, also being known as B Jack from our Cedar City office. He looks the best. He's got a good shirt on. He looks good. He cut the mullet though. I'm a little upset about that. Uh, he's not gonna go very far. Eight seed, when Bradley J. Miller came to Gohan, he refused to hunt with anything but a bow. The fact that he's an eight seed is very, very suspicious. The wild and famous handsome fella who runs our showroom He's about as charismatic as they come. Watch out, Paul, nine seed. I'm really looking forward to the match with him and Brady. He practices a lot more than Brady. I don't know if he's killed anything with his bow, but he practices a lot more. It'll be a very interesting matchup. Omar, brand new to go hunt from Portland, Oregon. New to hunting, does practice a lot. Athletic guy, pretty dedicated, loves running. Leonard Skinner, I didn't know that. Good musician. Keep your eye on Omar. Scotty Too Hottie, also known as Scott Christensen. Our head of HR, head of finance, guy wears a lot of hats here, been with Gohan a long time. I don't know much about his archery skills. Could be a sleeper though, loves fly fishing. Let's keep our eye on him. Adam, uh, he probably has four bows. Adam has like 16 guns, he likes to buy stuff. He's our number one customer at the Gohan shop, finance analyst, been with Gohan a year or so. Don't know much about his archery skills, but we're gonna find out. Bougie Boer. A little suspicious that he's the 13 seed. I don't know what to make of that. He's been hunting a long time. From Vegas, great guy on our content team. 13's a little low. I think he might have paid trail off on that one. Big G Garrett. Only been hunting a couple months. 14 seed makes sense. Think he could do well though. Him, Omar, they go to the archery range a lot on the weekends. Watch out for the new hunters. 15 seed. Uh, not really sure how he got in here. Uh, he's a header favorite label. Kevin, great human being. I, he's not a hunter and I don't think he shoots a bow. I think he wanted to participate. Um, he's probably a pretty big underdog. In the 16 seed, unfortunately I got trapped and I guess it is myself. I have shot a bow maybe 10 times in my life. Uh, I don't hunt with a bow yet. I will eventually. I have nothing but upside. I am competitive. I'm gonna go get focused. Probably will lose. But if I don't, Brandon will never ever hear the end of it. Welcome to round one contestants. Seeds one, two, three, and four. Get two arrows. You have to make two arrows. The rest of the contestants get one arrow. And yes, it is suspicious that Brady is not a top four seed, so that is strange. Hey, no pressure, bro. Baby. I don't know what I'm doing. Right? <laughs> no, you're good. Okay.
Listen, it's not that much pressure, Brandon. Just chill. It's all good. Just. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the production's a little stuffy. Why is Trail sniffing him? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That was very soft and too friendly. Whoa! New hunter, mostly a rifle hunter. in a fight between these two. <laughs> Sponsor plug. Oh, oh, that was, there's some swagger there. That was a very aggressive draw. Big dog, let's go. All right, we have a sudden death playoff. He did do arms today, so he is a slight favorite here. Green light, go. Bougie boy. Green light, go. We have a tie. Great performance. They just did a 30 second hold. They both hit it again. We're gonna go ahead and move them back once we get through this round. And we're gonna do another sudden death, a double sudden death. You. Did you just push Lorenzo? We have a potential upset. Oh. Oh! Good shot, sir. Good shot. Good shot. We have a second upset. Oh, oh, let's hope we don't get a 30 second hold on this one. Oh, the door is open. These are like smaller schools. They haven't been on the big stage before. They're just a little nervous. Oh, like butter. Green 
light, go. Green light, go. What would your hero, David Goggins, do with a shot like this? What would he do? Stay hard. Stay hard. You don't know me. Sir, clock has begun. B. Jack is literally licking his arrow. He's so excited. We have green light go. Can the young, handsome man from Portland, Oregon contain? Can he handle that? Green, light, go. Nice. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to have to take this to another sudden death in the next round. Brady's used to having a height advantage. In this matchup, he does not. He is wearing Nikes. I do not believe Nike supports hunters. LeBron, he's a goat. No, he is not the goat. Oh! Good shot, Bradley. <laughs> The local favorite, Paul, next up. Customer favorite. Nice. Oh! Oh! Yeah. Yeah. And we are green light go. Just simply skipping that workout. You you were focused, and the shakes came in. Green light, go. Good game, boys. Good game. Good game, gentlemen. Good game, gentlemen. I'm here with one of the upsets, one of the bigger upsets. Adam, how would your match go? You were up against Lorenzo, pressure was on, you came through, tell us about it. I mean, honestly, when I saw the bracket come out yesterday, I thought I was gonna have to throw it to keep my job. But then I realized if I did that, I'd lose Lorenzo's respect. So I said, I'm gonna give it my all and it paid off. Sometimes yeah. you get lucky. Have you been practicing? I've been practicing a little. By a little, I mean a lot. Did, did Lorenzo say anything to you? Lorenzo said he was going to do arm day this morning to try and give me a little handicap. So thanks, Lorenzo. Congratulations on your victory. We'll see Thank you in the you. next Thank round. You. I'm here with our very own Lorenzo Sartini. I have a lot of mixed feelings about this interview. I didn't want to do this interview, especially this early. Mm -hmm. Now, I know you've been busy with family. You haven't been shooting your bow a lot. Yep. Um, how are you feeling? Look, I'm not going to make excuses, but like, Target shooting, this is how you develop bad habits. Mm. You target shoot, you, pick, you spot pick, the whole thing. This is how you develop bad habits. I'm a killer. I like to kill shit. I'm just aiming for vitals. Mm -hmm. I'm not aiming for a little, you know, little circle on a metal target. Like, I'm not used, not to make excuses, but it just is, it is what it is. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not built for this. This isn't what I do. I agree. I mean, you have the most giant animals on the wall in the Gohan office, many with a bow. Mm -hmm. So your results could speak for yourself. Is there anything more to it, though? No. He is... Um, has he been practicing? Have you not been practicing? I mean, you looked like a killer. You got cowboy boots on. He comes up with his geeky little bow. Yeah. I mean, I thought you were a 50 to one favorite. I tried to play the part, dress the part, 
haven't shot my bow since September 6th of last year. Hasn't seen the light of day since uh, September 6th of last year. He's been shooting like crazy. He actually worked from home this morning so he could shoot all morning long. Come to find out, he's been practicing all morning. That was my first arrow off shot since September 6th last year. Not an excuse, just the reality of what it is. And I don't shoot targets. These, he shoots targets. My trophy's in my office. I don't need the trophy from this thing. My trophy's in my office. Anybody can go look at my office. That's all I need to know. Plot twist. We just learned Adam worked from home this morning to shoot his bow. Yeah. Not happy about it. Not happy. Wow. Wow. Braden and Bougie Boy, come up for your sudden death from round one, please. Sudden death round one. Good luck, Braden. Bougie bore a 13 seed, has the opportunity to move on with a giant upset if he can make the shot. Let's go, Goggins Jr. Oh! Quick shot, let's go. Sudden death extended. Can Goggins Jr. pull this off? Good try, bud. Good try. Thanks for playing, Omar. You fought, but you lost. He basically had a first round bye. This, he's coming cold. He's been sitting on the bench for a long time. Oh, he's a killer. He's a killer. Let's go! Thirty-second hold, another thirty-five shot. Green light, go. Green light go. I think that really has to do with you being a little cold. He's warm, he's back there building arrows like a little kid. He's kissing it. There it is! Oh! Let's go! Wow. wow.
Whoa. Did it? He clipped it. He clipped it. It was the veins. It was the veins. Very different kind of contenders. One has a very fancy, tricky bow. Bougie Boar looks like more of a just a free spirit killing. Oh. Fastest shot of the day. Did you see how fast that was? Come on, Cody. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Bougie Boar. As a 13 seed is in the final four. Bougie Boar, how are you feeling? You're shooting amazing. Uh, it's, it's, I'll, I'll be honest, it's pure luck. I sighted that thing in this weekend. I'm shooting arrows from a, a company we're not even going to name bow that I had five years ago. I mean, they're, I don't know how that bow shoots so good. It's, it's pure luck. Humble is his, is his strategy right now. Keep expectations low. You are beating incredible shooters so far. Congratulations to the Final Four. Keep up the momentum. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Can't wait. One of the fan favorites here, Branson B. Jackson, Jackson from our Cedar City, Utah office, I representing. I represent. How are you feeling? Welcome to the Final Four. I feel good. I feel like I'm meant to be here. Um, I might be an underdog, but I come swinging. I kind of feel like I'm here. Need to be here, really. Um, can you give us some context about the shirt? What made you go with the Tiger shirt? Uh, is there a brand or a sponsor plug you want to give there? Uh, I, I would love to. I would love for Gohan to bring this camo on. Um, I think it'd be awesome, but no, just my inner spirit animal. Um, and, you know, I feel like I needed that spirit here today, you know, represent. Meow. Did you just meow? I did. I did indeed. It should be more like a but just feeling meow today. Are you playing for anybody? Is there someone in your heart you're really shooting for? Uh, shout out to my fiance, Brickell. I'm playing for you. Look at that love story right here. <laughs> Good luck, B Jacking. Thank you. Big dog. Do it for Piper. Was that not just a couple inches high? That was close, wasn't it? Let's go! Oh! With the distraction of his dog in the background. Whoa! Be jacking, good luck. That was close. You can cut the drama with a knife in here. He went with the quick shot. Don't really know what to do. I think they both shot four times or five times. They're, they're out of arrows. So now we're borrowing from others. We're dealing with different length arrows. There's confusion. I think there's some nerves. I mean, it's 40 yards and the hole is small. 
do for the kids. Those are so close. Those are so close. I just dropped Chris. Can the Cinderella kid pull it off? Gentlemen, welcome to the finals. We have a nine seed coming in strong. We have a 13 seed coming in stronger. You're coming out of a fierce, fierce final four matchup. You're coming out in a little bit unscathed. You kind of smoothed in there. How are we feeling? Who do we feel like has the momentum? I'm gonna start with you first, Bougie Boar. You know, I, I'm giving it up to Paul, man. I mean, the guy, he's cool, calm, collected all the time. Uh, I'm intimidated. I really, truly am. It's, it's going to be one hell of a, a final, final matchup, and I'm really looking forward to it. Bougie Boar's committed to that reverse psychology and that humbleness. How are you feeling, Paul, and how is your mustache doing? The mustache is holding up. We had a talk. It's kind of step to the side, make sure motivation's there, focus is there. Uh, kind of give the upper hand to Cody. He's coming off of the shoot. The muscles are good, relaxed. I've been sitting for a little bit, so i uh, got to shake it out and we'll get back after it. Neither of you are going with the confidence, you're going with the hum humbleness. Good luck to you both. I was just told him the line. <laughs> you got this, Bob. <laughs> Welcome to the Sudden Death Finals. 50 yards. Good luck to you, sir. Let's go, Paul. Let's watch that toe. There you go. Wow. Come on, Cody, let's go, bud. His family's here. I'm here with the champion, Paul. And Piper, how did you do it? You did not miss a shot. 50 yards. You smoked it. Same spot at 45. Same spot at 40. How did you do it? Pure focus. Uh, it was actually one really funny thing earlier. Uh, Brady had mentioned messing with my release. And after that, I just locked it in. And that was it. So. Don't <laughs> uh, it was great to shoot against everybody. It was great to stay focused, uh, to represent Go Hunt HQ. Um, and uh, yeah, staying hard for everybody out in the crowd. Uh, I hope I get to motivate a lot of young men and women out there who want to shoot bows. Uh, GoHunt.com is where you can get all the gear to win Marjorie Madness. We appreciate the shameless plug. Uh, anyone that you want to thank on your way to this victory? Uh, I want to thank the support of Piper. Uh, if it wasn't for Piper promoting people in the showroom, I would have no existence. And I want to thank my great HQ team here at Go Hunt. Uh, we're going to keep thriving, baby. Let's go, Paul! Thank you. Uh, Lorenzo is going to come up here and he's going to present your prize. 
Paul, congratulations. There you go. <laughs> Victory! First annual winner. First annual champion. Are you already thinking about next year defending your defending your title? No, I'll worry about it when you get there. You're gonna enjoy it. Yeah. I'm going to Disneyland!